It's kind of horrible. It's just disgusting. Organizer of Northwest Side Community Development Corporation cleanup Denitra Jones says it's surprising what you'll find alongside the road. The snow has unearthed a lot of things like from diapers, tires, furniture, paper, litter. So instead of just looking at it, keep Greater Milwaukee Beautiful organized a campaign to get people excited about this effort. It's easy to sit back and complain about it, um, but instead, you know, wanted to, to be proactive and, and do something. And Milwaukee resident Lee Lanpan did something about it as he helped out his neighborhood near the west side. Universally, we all want the neighborhood to be clean. We all want the neighborhood to look good, and we all want our basic needs met. More than a dozen community organizations took to the streets of Milwaukee to do their part and pick up what they can. Instead of making the city dirty, you can make it clean. All it really takes is one person to do their part, and when everyone comes together, you have this, a trash container full of what once was things left on the side of the road. Now this container has nearly 80 bags of trash collected by 200 people in just four hours. This makes a difference. If you have beautiful places to live, people will behave beautifully. Glendale resident Sharon Satalowicz says she loves Milwaukee so much she tries to help out in any neighborhood. I cannot believe people will stop at stoplights and literally take their garbage bags and put them out. The solution to keep Milwaukee beautiful can be so simple. Keep up after yourself. Take responsibility for yourself. A community effort to make neighborhoods cleaner and safer. It's not just a one-time thing. It should be a consistent thing to clean up some of this trash around the community. Uba Ali, TMJ4 News. Adopt-a-Highway crews are also always looking for more hands. They pick up trash and recyclables along all of our state highways and rely on more than 2,700 volunteer groups to help. Just last year alone, they collected more than 81 tons of trash and recyclables. That's 162,000 pounds of just stuff along the highways. 